Well, I became an ophthalmologist because growing up, my grandfather actually went completely blind uh, from glaucoma. I used to take him to the ophthalmology clinic in New Zealand as a kid, and I saw how many people had problems with their eyes and vision. And that really inspired me to want to become an ophthalmologist and help people. Uh, I really enjoy what I do, but that was the start of it. Obviously, going through medical school, uh, you get to try different specialties. I realized that ophthalmology suited me. I like little fiddly things. I enjoy the artistic side of it. There's a lot of drawing and painting, but also the science side of it. I think I was a bit of an unusual kid. I used to read about physics and I used to enjoy that sort of thing. And so I think it's sort of the perfect combination of science and art and being able to help people. So that's my story and I'm really glad that I chose it. Uh, in ophthalmology, what drives me day to day would be probably the quest for perfection with refractive outcomes. So uh, I, I really aim for patients to have the best possible unaided visual acuity. I think that's what they want. They don't want to wear glasses usually. And so I'm pushing to try and improve my measurements, uh, to try and improve my surgical outcomes. And I think the technology is really advanced so that we can offer fantastic outcomes. And it's a once in a lifetime opportunity to give someone the vision they've always wanted. So that's what drives me day to day.